sweeping in off the plains of Oklahoma, Sooner football is back in the national spotlight. Wishbone football is a distant memory. Now the Sooners are taking flight on quarterback Hale Gundy's right arm. The Sooners blitzkrieg score from anywhere offense, strikes fear in the hearts of opponents, and has Oklahoma fans dreaming of the glory days of yesteryear. For the Texas Tech Red Raiders, it has been a tale of two seasons. A 1-5 nightmare became a 6-5 bowl season thanks to a battering ram named Bam. Byron Bam Morris chooses the path of least resistance through defenders to the end zone. It's Oklahoma versus Texas Tech, the John Hancock Bowl on CBS Sports. Christmas Eve in El Paso, Texas, as we welcome you to the John Hancock Bowl. And this could be a high-octane offensive show today, featuring the Texas Tech Red Raiders of the Southwest Conference and the Oklahoma Sooners of the Big Eight. Merry Christmas and season's greetings from all of us, everyone. I'm Dick Stockton. Texas Tech is no stranger to this particular bowl game, and Oklahoma certainly is no stranger to any bowl game, considering their rich football tradition. I'm joined by Randy Cross, and Oklahoma comes in 8-3 and three on the year, and they put a tremendous scare into undefeated Nebraska. We know about Cale Gundy and his passing ability, but there are two freshman tailbacks led by James Allen, also big threats for the Sooners. Well, when you talk about the Sooners, you talk about balance. 194 yards a game passing, 192 yards yards a game on the ground but really the key for the Sooners Gary Gibbs says are the two freshman running backs you've got to get the balance off the ground that sets up the play action that sets up the Sooners if there's a mismatch today as far as groups goes it's the defensive front seven of the Oklahoma second bowl game in the past five years and here come the red-shirted Sooners onto the field here in El Paso Gary Gibbs, who played and was an assistant coach at Norman, looking to see if the Sooners can finish on a high note and win their ninth game of the season. They won their first five this year. And we'll be back for the kickoff for today's Texas Tech-Oklahoma battle in just a moment. I'm sure it pleases the third member of our team to have clear skies today. Right now, let's go down to Pat O'Brien. Indeed, Dick. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas, everybody. You might say that nobody loves Texas more than Oklahoma during the course of this college football season. Take a look at these scores. Texas had their way. Oklahoma had their way with three Texas teams, TCU, Texas A&M. Look at that score. And Texas. So to commemorate this, they made a T-shirt that says Texas State Champions. Oklahoma players wearing them around town this weekend. But Texas Tech has other ideas to prove today that they are the lone star of this state. Let's go back up underway for the John Hancock Bowl on Christmas Eve and the kick sails into the end zone and it'll be down there by McHenry for a touchback and the Red Raiders will begin from the 20. Start but wound up with uh, nearly a 43 yard average will be kicking Darius Johnson the top returner back deep for Oklahoma on the 45 yard line gets into Texas Tech territory and Oklahoma will have terrific field position. Follow Second down and eight on the 35. Play fake, and Gundy is going deep. And the pass is caught. Corey Warren makes the catch inside the two-yard line. Verone McKinley defending on the play, and Oklahoma knocking at Texas Tech's door. Gain of 33. Gundy now with a full house backfield. And the first back through is Dwayne Chandler in for the touchdown. It didn't take long for the Sooners, and they lead it 6 to nothing. 
with the size advantage up front for that third. Ball has second and long now. And he gives to Morris. And Morris shows his disgust as Oklahoma. Gets close to the first down. A nine to make people miss. Leading rusher on the team, and the give is to Dwayne Chandler. He breaks the tackle, gets a first down, and rambles to about the 10-yard line. So Chandler, who scored the Oklahoma touchdown in the first minute in the team that beat you with the run. They send Hall and Warren to the right, and here is a jump pass caught by Ricky Brady for the touchdown. Ricky Brady, who went into the game as the leading receiver for Oklahoma, had the big height of more of a finesse group. Second down and 10, and the pass is caught. And that's Byron Baker who got hit as he caught the ball. Darius Johnson putting on the hit at a gain of five yards for Baker, who should start. Dick Stockton, Randy Cross, and Pat O'Brien here in El Paso. On first down from the 21, and Robert Hall could not find a receiver, and Terrell Peters. Just a freshman from Norman, Oklahoma, who's scoring in the second quarter thus far. Best starting field position for Texas Tech. And Hall, with a good fake, goes deep for Darren Mitchell, and he's got a big play for Texas Tech. He beat Darius Johnson downfield, and a gain of 46 this year will try a 22-yard field goal to put Texas Tech on the scoreboard, and the kick is good. John Davis, who is a pleasant surprise, a junior from Brandon, Mississippi, and Texas Tech is on the ball, trailing Oklahoma 14 to 3. seconds remaining in the half has scored again. You had to think that physical stop. Tech would have to get to the 33. They're almost there now. And the pass is intercepted by Mike Coates. Mike Coates, the linebacker downfield into Texas Tech territory. Yeah. And out of bounds to stop out that Tech threat. Those, including Texas A&M. Look at that big combined score, leading here 21-3. This is a situation you got to keep an eye on Brady. The tight end in the red zone, a big part of a passing offense. First down on the 15-yard line. Gundy drills it, caught, touchdown, and that's the tight end, Ricky Brady, and his second touchdown catch of the ball game. So Brady, in this game, has caught as many touchdown passes as he did in the regular season. Texas Tech 3. Pat O'Brien will be along with the college football today halftime after this message and a word from your local station. <laughs> 